Yo, yo, it's Bustian from BossLifeHacks.com and today I'm coming to you straight from New York City, um, somewhere in Manhattan, I don't even know exactly where I am. I am in my host place and it's pretty early, it's like 8 or 9 a.m. And today I will talk about laziness, more importantly, laziness manifesto. Um, I just read this piece in um, Tim Ferriss' book, the book uh, The Tools of Titans, and is it's a piece by Tim Crider, right? And this is so, so amazing, the laziness manifesto, right? So um, the thing is, look, it's, it's 8 or 9 a.m. I woke up, I had a good night's rest, and I have a shitload of things to do, right? I have to do, um, like, prepare content for a few videos. I have to, you know, work on my book promotion. I'll make a video about it, uh, about publishing today. I have to fix the covers, the interiors, set up the, set up the account, um, like, you know, arrange it with the Amazon, like all this shit, I have to respond to some friends that are reaching out to me, I have to then prepare uh, myself for the work, in a few hours I'll have to go work, I don't even have my groceries yet, I have to buy something to eat, you know, like, there's a lot of things I need to do, right, and I'm like crazy busy, right, and we hear this all the time, busy, 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 I'm busy, people are busy, right, everybody's busy, 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 busy. Oh, can you do this? No, I'm busy. Can you come out in the evening? I'm busy. Can you do this? No, I'm hustling, hustling, hustling. That has a place, but the laziness manifesto suggests just, just for some time, take some time off, unstructured time, completely unstructured. Do you remember when you were a kid and you just like went to the street and played or went to the forest I remember when we were kids, we went to the forest and we built like these tree houses for like the fans and shit and where we would like, we would like attack other kids from the neighborhood like with like sticks and, and throw apples at them and bullshit, right? Completely unstructured time. And funny enough, it's this unstructured time that actually gets you in the mood to create new ideas to think about life and, you know, about all these big picture questions, what's really important, you know. It takes time to, to go with somebody you like to the cinema, to go to a swimming pool, to sauna, you know, to just chill there for a while. It takes time and if you're too busy, you can't take that time. And what happens if you're too busy, like you have all these modern day diseases, neurosis, and it's very egoistic as well, you know. Um, somebody asks you to come out uh, at the evening with them and you say, yeah, I'll see what else comes up to and then, then I'll decide. You'll make the plan, you'll make the, you know, it's like a menu, Tim Crider suggests. Again, all my realizations here are largely based on the article. I'll post the links from Tim Crider in Ferris's book, Book of uh, Tools of Titans. Um, you know, it's like a menu. It's like a menu. Oh, will I um, go uh, out with Jenny? Will I go watch a uh, snooker with the guys? Will I um, watch the online CNC tournament? Will I go do breakdancing? It's like a fucking menu of best options. And I will see until 7 p.m. which ones come up. And then I'll decide for the one that will give me the most pleasure. Right? Bullshit. Bullshit. You know? And to be honest, most of the busyness is... <laughs> You know, like office work, you know, where you can actually do all the things from the eight hour shift in like two, if you put your mind to it. That's true. So um, I know it's a rant, but what I'd like to invite you to do is to become a little less busy, to allow yourself to become a little lazy, um, to just to just see, you know, to just chill. You know, I'm whatever, whatever it is that you like to do, but just not work, not busy. Because in the end, doesn't matter how much money you make. And and of course it's important and get your, you know, love life handled, get your emotional, get your, you know, like physical body, get your income up to, you know, all these things super important. I work on them every single day. But in the end, you're gonna fucking die and <laughs> you know, there is no way around it. So you should take time, you know, at least on a daily basis to to really just savor, just awe, oh, like breathe in, you know, enjoy life, you know, and I'm not saying like, yo, oh, but it's super crucial, right? Uh, a personal example, you know, is like, I'm super busy right now, right? I have to prepare content for like 
two new videos that I want to shoot here because I'm in New York. I have to work on my book promotion. It's coming out soon and it's not all the details are done yet. You know, book covers, blah, blah. I have to get groceries because I'm hungry. I didn't eat yet. I need chargers, uh, US because my computer will die. Like, uh, and then I I'm, I'm have to start working like three hours. I have to be ready with, with the camera gear in, in Central to shoot with Max and all that. So there's a lot of things I need to do, right? However, I'm on, like, you know, and I'm shooting this video right now because I want to create some content, but I'm in fucking New York City. I don't know, like for, for you guys, how this feels, but as a European, this is a pretty big deal, right? It's crazy. It's fucking, you know how crazy it is? It's fucking crazy. People plan like a year in advance to come here, you know? So um, I'm really happy I read that piece. I'm really happy. And now I will just take two or three hours completely off. I'll just go do groceries for the food, nothing else. Uh, I, I won't even take a shower. Fuck that. So um, I hope this helps you a little bit. Uh, it's a rant. It's going to be a short video, but it's really important. So... Um, I'd like to uh, tell you one more time, this was uh, summarized by an article from Tim Kreider uh, from Ferris's book, Tools of Titans. Super, super important. Please don't be too busy all the time. Um, get some time off, get some time to play, uh, experience things, you know, like kids. And uh, hope you like this video. I'll come back with more and uh, take care.